Hi there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to use the Bing Image AI Generator. And right now, to enable this website, I just simply want you to go to this link. So it's gonna be www.bing.com and create. So you don't really have to copy all the way here. You only have to type in www.bing.com images or create. And you'll arrive on this landing page. Now that being said, this should be the landing page you should be seeing on your end also. Now I'm going to teach you or let you know the key features here and please stay at the end of the video because I'm going to give you a bonus tip. So let's get started. So with this one, just like any other AI generated image tool, you have the templates of other creators right here, their outputs. Now if you want to create your own, simply type in on this prompt bar. Let's call it prompt bar, okay? So as you can see right there, there is a text that says want to see how image creator works. Select surprise me then create. So there is an option that says surprise me. If you click on this one, you'll have a prompt that was given to um to us by AI. So I didn't type bright eye makeup looks, rather AI typed that for me. So simply click on create with this one and you'll have that bright eye makeup looks. But for me, I'm going to create for myself. I'm going to go a wizard in a forest and click on create. Now that being said, let's wait for it to finish. And it will direct us to this landing page you'll see, right? And while waiting for it before I'll wait for it to finish, you'll see this tab right here. This tab on the right side shows the recent created um, images by me, of course. Now that being said, this is the wizard in the forest, so we don't have to wait for it that much. It only took around 30 seconds. So you'll have two options for it, and you'll see on the right side already right there. Let's try the surprise me option. For example, I will click that one. It will give me Indigo Dahlia Macro Photography. Let's click on Create. And then you'll see or notice that the wizards are still here. So if you click on them, you can still work with them. You'll have options for the sharing, save, download, and of course, customize. Now, I'm going to teach customize the next one. But for before I go into that, simply click on that escape button and let's wait for the prompt that was given to us by Bing. And I'll get back to you once it's here. So welcome back. This is gonna be the Dahlia, or Indigo Dahlia Macro Photography. If you're gonna ask me, it's really good. Read here's this one. So let's try choosing one, for example, I want this one for to be specific. And then you'll see this option customize. If you click on this one, you'll be directed on a new landing page. Let me just click it right now. So you'll arrive in Microsoft Designer, much like Canva. You'll have the tools on the left, you have templates, media, visuals, and so on and so forth. And basically, it's just editing or customizing the photo you got. That's exactly the meaning to it. If you're satisfied with this one, simply click the download button right there, and simply click on download. You're good to go. Let's go back to Bing, this one right here. Now, a bonus tip for you guys, almost forgot, since you're at this part of the video. If you click on this icon on the top right, you'll see this one. Basically, not much people knows about this, so it's just going to be Copilot or Bing Chat. You have three options, more creative, balanced, or more precise. Basically, it's an AI you can talk to. So let's try this one. Um, Create this image and then type this one, click on enter, and let's wait for it to finish how it works, okay? I'll get back to you once it's here. So welcome back. This is going to be the image generated via the copilot or Bing chat. As you can see right there, this is going to be my prompt. And then this is with the reply. And basically, these are the images. So you can you don't need to go to this website, the one I gave earlier. You can just simply click on that top right section and create your generate images right here. It's basically the same. And that being said, this is how you use Bing chat to create AI images. So thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye for now.